Hi there, this is Alvin with kickstartcommerce.com and in today's tutorial I will be showing you how to list category posts using a WordPress plugin. Um, so essentially what we will do, I will use a good friend's website, engagingLifesMoments.com and so the premise of this tutorial is basically to show you how you can list um, various category types. So let's say that you have a category type and I believe here um, as we scroll down you'll see there's a test post so in this test post we go to this page and there is test post and then it has basically a category associated with it which I'll show you here um, right here so that posted in is really a category and it's called test and so let's say that you had a blog that you had a certain number of posts within a given category and you want it to display this list of posts on a certain page uh, then you could basically use the plugin that I'm about to show you so let's go ahead and I'm already logged in so we'll go to the uh, admin area here and so once you get to the admin area then go to plugins and then you can go ahead and click add new and then the plugin that we are looking for is called list category post so you can go ahead and search for that I already have the plugin installed and activated uh, it's likely going to appear an install button is going to appear or install now button will appear for you you go ahead and click that and then once it installs then click activate now once it's activated you can then go to um, a page and we're just going to use the blog page here and edit and you can see we already have other short codes that are in there that are pertaining to other plugins um, so never mind that so what I've done is I already had a a short code for from the plugin which is called cat list uh, that that short code is and then basically what I'm telling it to do is list a number of posts um, so 10 posts at the most from the category named test now you may be wondering where did I get that code from um, and that that's a good good question valid question and so if you open up another um, browser tab then visit wordpress.org and if you go ahead and if you were to type in list category post it'll take you to a search results page then you would click that list category post um, link and it will take you to this page here for the plugin and this is the list category post plugin by Fernando Briano and it gives you basically a brief description and see there's where you can see this is where I derived the cat list short code and so um, it, the good thing about this is this page is actually gives you full documentation so if you click this link it'll take you over to this page which shows you how to uh, select which post to show it shows you all the parameters that are involved in it also shows you how to get pa uh, pagination as well as the HTML and CSS customization which I won't go through in these tutorials but I wanted to show you that they they actually provide you um, with great documentation so if you can read and, and kinda work your way through step by step then you'll be able to use this plugin um, gain access to the various parameters that you like to show for uh, different categories as well as be able to add pagination to it as well as to customize it because out of the box which you'll see here momentarily it is just a bulleted list of posts so let's go ahead and jump back in I've already added that short code in we'll go ahead and save it alright it's saved we'll go back to the to the site and then we'll click the blog link is here on this page and so you should see a test post in a bulleted list and there it is so if we had more they would all be bullets and then once they got to 10 um, it only show the latest 10 post and by default it's not going to show the 
pagination. You'll have to add that short code in, like I said, using going back over here and using the pagination and reading how to paginate uh, your post list. And so with that, I hope that this tutorial uh, helped you out um, greatly in terms of being able to display category uh, specific posts on any given page. WordPress page and the good thing about it is you can also use the short code not only in your pages but you can also use the short code in your widgets so you could list out uh, certain ones in your sidebar if you want it and so that being said like I said I hope this helps if let me know if you have questions or comments please leave them below the video uh, please also subscribe to this YouTube channel I drop a video each week sometimes pertaining to search marketing and how to boost your traffic or uh, WordPress tips and tricks as well as sometimes domain name investing strategies uh, to actually grow your business so please subscribe also visit kickstartcommerce.com and subscribe to our weekly newsletter where I share where you'll actually get the the heads up um, notice long before uh, general public does so pl please feel free to subscribe there like I said let me know if you have any questions. Thanks, and that's all for now.